Maggie Moo. Thank you for joining me today. I am going to be discussing some cleansing method to remove negativity, jinxes, curses, or crossings from you by using an egg. If this sounds like it is something that is of interest to you, stick with me because we are about to get witchy. So the first method of using an egg for cleansing yourself of any blockages, negativity, curses, crossings, tricks, or whatever, um, will be you take an egg, um, an organic egg if possible, but you know what, use whatever you have. Um, this one came right from my chicken coop, so it's as organic and as happy as I can, can get. Um, you'll take an egg and a white cloth and maybe a white candle. Again, all the props really, aren't all that necessary. Use what you have, okay? Or use what you can get. You'll have some cleansing incense, perhaps dragon's blood or frankincense. You'll have some consecrated water, which you will consecrate um, perhaps with, consecrate the water and then bless the salt, mingle the two together, stir three times clockwise and bless it in the names of whatever deities or spirits that are meaningful to you, or if it's just yourself, your higher self, or whatever it may be, okay? Once that is done, you will sprinkle the egg with the salt water, or if holy water is meaningful to you in your practice, you will acquire some holy water and use that instead. For me, I am a priestess of my art and the god of my life, so I make my own holy water with sea salt and water. I consecrate the water and I bless the salt. I add them together and they become a tool of my magical arts, okay? So you will sprinkle that upon the egg. You will call to your higher powers, whatever they may be, your ancestors, Lucifer, Lilith, whoever, okay, to be with you and help you in removing any negativity, any crossings, any curses or whatever from you. You will start at the crown and moving away from you. You will visualize any negativity, any curses, any crossings being absorbed into the egg, okay? And you will do this all the way down all around yourself as best you can. And during this, you could say any chant that you wish um, or just continue in a prayer or a mantra you know, that is associated with the working, any words that are meaningful to you and you will continue to do so all the way down. Roll the egg down your stomach, your belly button, your genitalia, continuing down each leg into the feet bottom of the feet and then once you're done you're going to take the egg and you're going to toss it into the toilet with some salt and flush it and then you're going to go and take a warm bath and in this warm bath you can add two cups of salt and if that's all you have that's fine if you have any of these that makes it all the better some lemon essential oils a third cup of baking soda, and some rose petals, rosemary, and rue. Any or all of those, if nothing else, the salt water. That's fine, okay? But if you have any other cleansing herbs, you will use that as well, okay? You will light a white candle by your tub, and you will soak in there for at least 25 minutes. When you are done, you can smudge yourself, smudge your feet, dispose of any remaining candle wax or any remaining ingredients from the, the cleansing tub in any way that you so desire. Another thing that you can do is if you feel like you have been cursed or hexed and you want to remove any negative energy from you, okay, you will place an egg in a glass of water and you will keep it under your bed for nine days. And on the morning of the 10th day, you will take the egg away from the water and you will toss the egg 
over the roof of your home. And so it is done. Another way to use an egg to cleanse your home would be first you open all of the windows in your home to ensure that all the negativity can get out. You will light a white candle, some frankincense or dragon's blood or something like that. You'll take the egg in your dominant hand and stretch it out in front of you. And you'll go into every room saying a chant or a prayer that is meaningful to you. And you, in the chant or prayer, you are removing any negative spirits, any negativity, any curses, and you'll do this in every single room. And then you can either chuck the egg into the toilet with a handful of salt and flush it, or again, throw it over the roof of your house, away from your house. Or you can break it in a glass of water, okay? Flush it or dispose of it at a crossroads. Eggs are very powerful things. They're very protective as well. Never underestimate the simple things that you have around your home that could add a powerful punch to your magic. I hope that this has been of some help to you. If you have any rituals or spells that you use for protection or removal, let me know in the comments below. I am always interested in knowing what other witches out there like to do. And until next time, I wish you dark and